Well, praise the Lord, show family. This is Dr. Bernetta, and uh, we say a great big God bless you from the Staples household. Certainly, we pray that this set of messages finds you in a very, very happy place with Jesus. Amen. It's my privilege to share some announcements with you so that you can know what's going on in your wonderful church. Our first couple announcements are somewhat solemn. We want to inform you of the homegoing service from Minister Wilborn, and that's coming up for her and her family this Saturday, February 26th at 11 a.m. right in our sanctuary. And so we do want you to plan to join us if you're able and be prepared to wear masks and sit socially distanced in that service. Also, our dear Pastor Marvin Miller, many of you know he has also gone on to be with the Lord and uh, our Deacon Miller and his family. We wanna support them certainly with our prayers and our words of comfort. Also, we want to give financially to support that family. So there is a GoFundMe page that is there on the Shield pay, um, Facebook page, um, but you can also support through our regular church giving opportunities. So you can use Sell or Giveify and just mark it for the Miller family. And certainly we do pray for them that God will comfort them in this time. Our next announcement is one of excitement because our first day of giving is coming up. That's right, it's already here. March 6th, Sunday, March 6th will be our day of giving. And we're asking everyone to talk to the Lord and get your quarters and dimes, nickels and those $100 bills together so that you can give to the support of this amazing ministry. Those of us that have given over the years, we have plenty of testimonies of how when we dig deep, when we give, God gives right back. So um, I, we look forward to that opportunity and hopefully you'll join a team. You'll get, you're gonna get a call about joining a team and just be encouraged about that and participate. Let's enjoy the opportunity. He said it is more blessed to give than to receive. So let's get that blessing, amen? All right, now this announcement comes directly from Apostle Alexander's heart, but I wanna put a second on it. You know, the numbers have gone down. Most of us are vaccinated and boosted, and many of us are doing a lot of the things that we had done before the COVID shutdown. It's time for us to really come back to church. And I wanna say something about that because this may just be a break, right? We don't know what's gonna come, but I know I can confess, I miss seeing faces. I miss those uh, moments together in person. You and I both know it's, it's just better, right? So we wanna encourage you. We really wanna beg you and plead you. If at all you are able, please make your way back into the sanctuary to just join us in person. We, we are continuing to wear masks. We're continuing to sit socially distanced. But I tell you, there's something about, there's a blessing on us coming. And while we have the chance, I think we ought to take advantage of it, amen? All right, those are your announcements for the week. And we pray that you will govern yourself accordingly. We hope to see you soon. Remember our prayer times and remember your uh, daily reading from the book of Proverbs. I tell you, that's good food for the soul. Know that I love you. God bless.